Hi, boys and girls, Miss Lehman here to talk to you about our second part of science. We started this on Tuesday and we are continuing with the lesson. Today, we're going to try to do the lab. Now, remember that you are not at school, so you may not have all the materials. And if you don't have the materials, then try to find some other materials instead. But you can see here that we are about at this part of the lab. Um, and we move forward Get and I, supplies. ideally you would have your supplies. Your supplies would be an umbrella top. You can print that out from mystery science or look, you can even draw your own. It's simply a circle. You would have a Dixie cup with some Play-Doh in it. But if you don't have a Dixie cup, a small cup that maybe you could put even some rocks or some dirt down at the bottom. The stickers, you could draw something, a pair of scissors, some pipe cleaners, a straw. You can be creative in finding something else. And then you would work your way through the lab. So you're going to write your name on your umbrella pattern. Write your name, then but cut you're at a circle on the solid line. You're at home by yourself. So if you had to draw your own and you couldn't write your name, that's okay. So you would work your way all the through. Cut all, on the dotted line until you reach the stop sign. All the way through. And you can see that even if you had to draw your own, stop. you could okay. get help like this, seeing where you need to do that because you're going to end up connecting it. So you will work your way through the whole lab. And obviously I'm going very quickly but um you your parents Hold can be your partner and then the you can practice the lab just do your very best that you Let's can do stay up in the wind if you're in a group your teacher will be the big wind so if you're working alone you'll have to be your own wind you could even make wind, wind See Stand this hat? You could even make wind with a hat. Gently wave the fan back and forth like this. So you can Do see. Do your umbrellas stay up in the wind? Doug. Ours didn't. So you can see that you can make wind with something. You should be able to do that. And then um, there's ways to there's invent different umbrellas, and you can see that. So you're going to work your way through the lab the very best that you can. When you are done working your way through the lab, then you will post your results on a Seesaw video. You don't have to video yourself doing the experiment, but actually you just need to video yourself talking about how your experiment went. What did you make your umbrella with? And when you put it through the wind test, did it make, um, did it stand up through the wind test? How about your revised umbrella, the second one you made? Did that one work or not? So I just can't wait to hear the details. Please don't stress if you don't have the exact materials. Do the best you can with the materials. If you have no materials at all, then watch the videos and um, that Doug did here. And then you should be able to still talk about what happened in a Seesaw video for us. All right, thank you, and happy Science Day to you, and I can't wait to hear all about this experiment.